She actually retired from her paying job a while ago, but she's had a full-time plus volunteer position for more than 10 years, which helps people put food on the table and get through financially challenging times. Rhonda Howard is tonight's Unsung Hero. This one has our overflow bags, but it was full of shrimp, bags of shrimp. Rhonda Howard, director of food pantry at New Creation Church of God in Flint Township, is checking on supplies. I had some meal type items here and canned goods, and I put the dates on them so I can use the oldest stuff first. It's the third Thursday of the month when the church welcomes the community to pick up groceries and toiletries whatever they need to get by. And that means a lot to get extra food when you, you don't make your bills, you know, you got your doctor bills and medicine bills to pay. Rhonda is at the center of what happens, but it takes a village of volunteers to help her serve the dozens of people and organizations who need the help. More than 100 people a month rely on this food pantry for their food, and there are many organizations who turn to them when they need food for their clients. Miss Rhonda is wonderful, you hear me? That lady is awesome. She goes beyond her call of duty to make sure you get what you need. Rhonda took over managing the operation more than 10 years ago, which is a partner agency of the Food Bank of Eastern Michigan. She was always in there. And if she had four feet, she got them all in there. <laughs> Rhonda orders the food every month. I have a budget with the church that I use to purchase food and we get donations, monetary donations, uh, food donations from a lot of the church members. So, so far we're managing. The process includes packing the bags of necessities, placing them in boxes, and even friendly customer service all the way out to the parking lot. Community partners offer health screenings, vaccines, and other services on distribution day. Rhonda's reasons for working countless hours to coordinate this labor of love nearly a decade after retiring come straight from the heart. It's the people that are coming to get the food. It's the people I work with, and I just enjoy helping, helping the people. The price of food has gone up, but it hasn't stopped Rhonda and her team. She says a case of 15 dozen eggs used to be more than $3, and now it's nearly $31 for the same case. That's why donations of non-perishable foods with current use-by dates, toiletries, including toothpaste and toothbrushes, and cash donations are always welcome. We want to know more about the remarkable people who are giving back to their mid-Michigan community. So please tell us about those unsung heroes. Send us an email to news at NBC25news.com. Attention, Stella. Well, I bet Rhonda and her team, they uh, team of volunteers, put in a lot of hours to make all of this work. They definitely do, and it's way more than full-time work. You've got Rhonda oh, yeah. who, who puts in a lot of hours. Her volunteers donate several hours. And... I was really struck they serve a wide variety of people and those people are very appreciative of what they're getting and it's so heartwarming to see this gesture of kindness and what's even nicer too is you've got other agencies and other organizations who are helping Rhonda and it just, it was, it, it was wonderful to see this all happen. And we want to see all of the unsung heroes. If you're out there watching, email Stella, message on Facebook. Yes. and. Uh, you have lots of stories to tell. Yes, we have lots of stories to tell. Thank you.